and leave it to contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. He, Reggie walks in looking really cool. He's got a Google Glass on, and I'm like, man, that's cool. And did he walk what did like you? That? Yeah, he walked like that. That's how you walk if you got <laughs> Google like Glass that? on. Everyone really? walks real cool. Reggie Middleton. Middleton. Reggie Middleton. Reggie Middleton. <laughs> Reggie Middleton. Oh, he doesn't mince his words. We're talking about Reggie Middleton. <laughs> so far ahead of everybody and so detailed and then he started warning about Bear Stearns and Lehman well he was so far ahead of the curve I actually thought he was nuts he called the housing crash he called the collapse of Bear Stearns and Lehman Brothers he's been harping on the crisis in the eurozone banking system for years now so he's just the guy to talk to well, he told us how zero zero percent interest rates were starving the banks that they, it was designed to save now at the time you were the only analyst in the world to mention that it would starve the banks and, and you've been proven correct. Reggie Middleton, who nailed Facebook, by the way. The crown, the champion, the winner of the first ever CNBC Stocks Draft. Yay! Reggie, Reggie Middleton! It was Google, which was up by 46%. Reggie! Well done, Reggie Middleton. But you know what, Reggie? This is a double amazing feat because last year you won as well. I mean, not to be impolite, but what makes you so special that they all want to read your blog? Um, I can step on toes and be objective, objective and uh, offensively honest. That's not, not their fight. They don't manufacture. They the don't manufacture. Google is a service company, and they do manufacture. They own Motorola. Does Motorola manufacture? They just acquired Motorola. Okay, well then you answered your question. Now, oh, oh, yeah. you answered your question. You answered your own question. I didn't have to do it. For you. And Reggie Middleton, editor of the Boom Boss blog, and I should note that Reggie put a note out to his clients. I'm not sure the exact price point on Apple, but it was doggone near the top, saying get out of the stock. It was a great call. The risk that you see going on in investment banks being blown up was unheard of just a few years ago. The reason why you have that now and you didn't have it back then is because investment banks are using OPM, other people's money. They were able to lever up and take risks because the risk they were taking now was primarily public stockholders' money. When you're using someone else's money, you can be extremely, extremely risky, which brings in the investment bank cart uh, cartel, pardon me, the investment banking industry. You could short J.P. Morgan, you can go long the Korean won. You could do all really this. really hate J.P. Morgan, right? <laughs> not <laughs> not about hate, it's business. Business is business, business, right? I don't want to put him out yeah. of the door. It's, it's business, not personal. The banks are going to hate you. And like, leave it to contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. Contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. Contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. <laughs>